to his left. A lucky escape. Big names keep coming. It's not been the USA's day, but Bodie Miller next out onto the course. Seventh in training and fourth. His best ever here in Bormio. And what a surprise. Miller's attacking. <laughs> yeah, look here. This is the section where Bauhofer was in trouble. Miller definitely in charge of his skis here. And this is the section that he won in both of the training runs. Let's see how he did it. Taking risks as usual. Bodie Miller, he's got this nice touch. We've talked about some of the other skiers having that, but Miller seems to find that nice touch in the most extreme situation and look at the time he's made up through here into Carcentina right on the money millimeter precision from Miller it looks ragged upstairs watch what's happening below his knees the skis are carving so cleanly this is lightning on the entry to the jump from Miller beautiful stuff from Miller it's so Miller isn't it getting himself out of trouble all the way down this tricky course but everybody's had to do that today this man is more adept than anyone at doing that beautiful flight from the San Pietro it was long but he touched down so smoothly surely yes the green light and look at the speed gun 114.3 kilometers per hour Bodie Miller as long as he doesn't put a foot wrong is going to take this and the 30-year-old American, just when everybody is starting to write him off, has a chance here to silence the critics at the end of the year. No problem from here on in for Miller. He's so high in the line, he can afford to point the skis down the hill, relax the legs, drop into the tuck. This is his for the taking. Looking good, but it's time. 2 minute 0102, and it's been beaten convincingly. Miller moves to the top. What a run from the American. That was some ski from Miller. Unbelievable stuff. We saw it in training through the entry to Carcentina, through the exit. He's been head and shoulders above the rest of the field for the last couple of days. And now, three days in a row, when it really matters, look at his position on the mountain compared with everybody else. And as I say, don't watch what's happening upstairs. Look how cleanly the skis are running over the snow. Perfect combination. He's got such fantastic equipment this year. Back on head skis. Miller must be so...